What's good YouTube, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be taking you through my six snacks to help you bulk up fast. If your focus right now is to bulk up or to gain mass, gain some size, then bulking snacks is one of the most efficient ways that you can actually get there. Adding in many little meals or just a little addition to your current diet plan can make all the difference. So if that's you right now, make sure you subscribe and hit the like button and watch the rest of this video. To be in a bulk just means your body is in a caloric surplus and the amount of calories that is being taken in is higher than the amount of calories that the body burns. And typically is recommended to be in uh, anywhere from three to 500 extra calories of a caloric surplus if you're trying to lean bulk or gain mass. The first one is avocados. Now, personally, I'm not gonna be here and, and just say that I absolutely adore avocados. No, I don't actually really like the taste of avocados that much. I used to like it back in the day, but I'm not a huge, huge fan of the taste of avocados. However, you are a results oriented individual, okay? I'm giving you that attribute right now. You are results driven. Your goal is to gain mass. So whether or not you like avocados, it is absolutely amazing for calories. One avocado has approximately 160 calories and 29 grams of fat. Avocados are absolutely essential. And let me tell you why. An extra 160 calories is okay, all right, in just one avocado. Now, if you take two avocados in just one single day, that's an extra 320 calories. Remember how I said earlier, a caloric surplus can be anywhere from three to 500 extra calories per, let's say per day, then that just two avocados is almost going to meet at that caloric surplus recommendation area or region immediately. It's one of the most calorically dense, you know, bulking snacks that you can have and I think is absolutely essential. So make sure you eat your avocados, man. Eat your damn avocados. The next snack, and you have seen me eat this several times on my channel, is peanut butter on toast. Now, I'm telling you, when I say that peanut butter on toast is magical, I mean it. It has some sort of magical power in terms of calories, in terms of taste, in terms of, I don't know, just, just superpowers. Two slices of toast is about 184 calories and 6.8 grams or 6 to 7 or 8 grams of protein. Let's just say generally speaking, anywhere from 6 to 8 grams of protein and 184 calories. Two tablespoons of peanut butter is 188 calories, give or take of course, and 8 grams of protein. That is absolutely massive. Why do I say that? If you piece those two together, you can get anywhere from 350 to 400 calories from just two slices of peanut butter toast and four to 14 to 15 grams of protein in just literally two slices of toast. Now, remember what I said, you're results driven. You are results oriented. I typically take two not just two, but four slices, right? And just have them in two. It is not that filling. It is very, very easy to consume. And that actually gives me an extra 740 to 50 extra calories and 28 grams of protein from just two, like four slices of toast and four tablespoons of peanut butter, which is also really good pre-workout just because of the fat content, which can be used as, as a source of energy when you go on a workout just before exercise. So peanut butter on toast is an absolute, absolute, absolute magical superpower. Trust me when I say it, it's magical. Absolutely magical, absolutely magical. The next snack is red grapes. Red grapes are a great source of antioxidants and phytonutrients, which is important for your health and heart. It's not something that is calorie dense, but it's very important in terms of muscle recovery and the muscle building process and getting the most out of your exercise, the most out of your training and the most out of your nutrition. So make sure you take some source of antioxidants if it's not red grapes. I personally say red grapes because 
In terms of all of the grapes, it has the highest amount of antioxidants and phytonutrients. The next is bananas. Now, this is bananas is probably one of the most well-known um, source, the, the well-known snacks. It's one of the easiest snacks. Everybody has it in their household. But the reason why it's important, first of all, one banana can be anywhere from like 85 to 90 calories, depending on its size, of course, like a, a, a regular sized banana. However, it is important because of its fiber content. And fiber plays an important role in your bowel, in your digestive system, keeping your digestive system healthy and functioning as well as possible. So personally, I'd like to take bananas in groups of two or three. The reason why is because like I said, anywhere from 80 to 90, let's just stick with 90 calories per banana, okay? Now, if I take two bananas, that is 180 calories in one sitting, all right? Just two bananas. Now, if I take two bananas at 11 o'clock in the morning and just before I go to the gym, I take another two bananas, I've just got 360 calories just from bananas alone. It's just an awesome way to sneak in extra calories every now and then. There is absolutely no worries when taking bananas, I think, because of the amount of fiber it has and you know slowing down the amount of sugar that your body takes in and you know there's a lot of misconception that it, you shouldn't be taking too much sweet bananas no you shouldn't be taking too many sweet beverages or fruit juices because the fiber is pretty much extracted from all those different types of fruit juices and the sugar content just protects your insulin but if it's fruit itself, the fiber will slow down that insulin response and it's totally fine. So if you're bulking, taking bananas is awesome. Taking it in two quantities of two to three is absolutely fine, it's absolutely awesome. I would recommend it. So eat your bananas, man. Number five is cashews. Cashews are one of those more on the higher end in terms of its expenses more on the higher end purchase bulking snacks. However, one cup of cashews is 500 plus calories, which is insane. Compare that to red grapes, as I mentioned earlier, red grapes is about 100 calories per cup, whereas cashews is about an extra 500 calories. Cashews are really good for its protein and its fat content as well, so it's also another good pre-workout snack to have or you know have it as a, you could have it as a pre-workout meal just to up your fat your fat content before workout um, and it's just really really calorie dense like it's so easy to eat taking just 10 raw cashews is going to give you 98 calories from just 10 cashews alone so that is huge you know they're such small little nuts but 10 of them is an extra 100 calories Imagine if you take 30 of them, but you split them up into different intervals. Like I suggest in my other video on three tips to gain weight is to snack in between. Taking 10 cashews in between your bigger meals, even if it's three big meals in the day, is going to give you an extra 300 calories as well. An extra 300 calories, if you take 10 cashews and two bananas, piece that together, that's going to be an extra 300 calories calories in that specific meal three times that could be almost a thousand calories worth of snacks from just cashews and bananas now this is what i mean by being smart with the way that you implement extra calories into your food and cashews is one of them the last one is apples which is pretty much the same as bananas apples are about 95 calories per apple also high in fiber so there is there's no worry when it comes to you know overeating apples or overeating fruits because of its sugar content one apple and two bananas is going to give you almost 300 calories about 260 270 calories so Apples is also a great way to get extra calories, especially because of its taste. When it comes to bulking snacks, I think there is a measure between easily accessible, convenient, and healthy. Having a balance between these three is going to give you a more realistic, you know, and effective way to gain weight and eat habitually. The reason why I say that is because you can easily piece together a banana and an apple. If you're having the most lazy, you know, two hours where you really don't feel like making food or you're like, oh my goodness, I have to go and eat. It's not that hard to literally go to your kitchen, go grab an apple, go grab two bananas and there's an extra three, 400 calories. You know, 
uh, go grab some cashews, 10 cashews and throw it in a bowl. There's an extra 100 calories. You put that together with your banana and you go, you go and make some peanut butter on toast. It's, it's very convenient, it's easily accessible, and on top of that, it's healthy, you know? And you can obviously add in that it tastes well, but the main thing is to be able to eat snacks or things that you enjoy relative to its health and its convenience. You know, that's what's gonna make you eat more. Like, you know, I love red grapes. I love the taste of red grapes. I, that's why I eat them more. You know, I love the taste of peanut butter on toast as well. And those are my six snacks to help you bulk up fast. So if you enjoyed this video, please let me know down below, drop a comment. Um, let me know what type of videos you'd like to see when it comes to bulking. That's what I'm going through right now. So I'm trying to share as much information as I can you know, with what I'm experiencing at the same time. So, none of this is bogus. Like, it's not just me talking out of my backside. You know what I mean? Like, this is what I'm currently going through. This is what's working for me. And this is the type of information that I love to share is information that I'm currently experiencing and going through. So, yeah, I hope that's helpful. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please hit the subscribe button. Ring the notification bell, support the channel, road to a thousand subs, it says up there, road to a thousand, and as always, take care.